This is an example about dividends count model. The example is Pioneer Limited has a current dividend of $5 per share. The current share price is $50. Pioneer Limited has a dividend payout ratio of 40% and expected return on equity of 15%. Calculate the cost of Pioneer Limited Common Equity. So let's start with the variables given in the question. So we have a current dividend. Current, it means at present, it means now. So this is D0, not D1, equal to $5. And then the current share price, it means at the price today, B0, which is 50. Then we have dividend payout ratio of 40% and return on equity of 15%. So what is the formula of dividend discount model? The price today equals the dividend after one year divided by I minus G. So can we rearrange this formula to put I in one side, all other variables in the other side? Yes. Swap B0 with I minus G and then put G's other side. So our I, which is the cost of equity, is equal to D1 divided by B0 plus G. So in the question, we don't have D1, we have D0. So can we calculate dividend at year one from dividend at year zero? Yes. So we'll say that our dividend in year one equal to dividend of the previous period, which is dividend at year zero, multiplied by one plus G, divided by B zero plus G. So in the question here, we don't have a growth rate. So can we calculate growth rate from our financial ratio formulas? Yes. The formula of sustainable growth rate is G equals return on equity multiplied by one minus dividend payout ratio. So, Let's substitute with our variables to calculate G. So G equals return on equity of 15% multiplied by open bracket, one minus dividend payout ratio of 40%. This will give us a gross rate of 9%. Then let's substitute in our formula of our cost of equity. So our cost of equity is current dividend of five multiplied by open bracket one plus G of 9% close bracket divided by the price of 50 plus G, which is 9%. This will give us I or cost of equity of 19.9%.